Hello YouTubers and welcome to episode 10 of season 7. Today we're on day 2 of Inverness Hen where, and now, instead of racing in a sweet boat, we get to race in the sculling boat. So today we're in a quad, that's a four man sculling boat, and we're in a single. In the Lamborghini name yet to be determined, which I'm really excited about. I had a fantastic sleep overlooking the highlands of Scotland here at Alan's parents' house. Absolutely fantastic, but now it's time to head to the course. Get ready to go race in the quad, are you? And we've made it to the course. Look at this glass water we get to row on in the quad this morning. I'm actually a little bit nervous to row on this one. In the four, I was feeling really comfortable. In the quad, I feel a little bit less comfortable. Is it something I've done a lot less over my rowing career? So I'm going to try as best I can to, to scull as best I can. But having this glass water makes it that little bit easier to do so. So now we're going to get the boat, which is over there somewhere, and get it on this glass water and see how we get on. Oh, you. Hugo, Matthew, Dale, me. <laughs> oh, we're rolling it down. Where is it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, right, yeah, that's, we made it. Hook is all the way. Go. Ah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You guys got You guys got Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. made it to the start line. You're the only person actually who's got a, a heavyweight. So many boats are waiting. <laughs> it's gonna be a big one. Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh, I'm 
and we've finished racing the quad. We've got one more race to do today, but before that, we have to go fuel up. The results are out for the quad. I believe we won. Absolutely fantastic. So two for two now to see what happens in the Lamborghini name yet to be determined on what looks like the glass again. But we'll see if the wind picks up like it did when we got to the start in the previous race where we ended up racing. It looks like no wind here, about 5k up the course. There was a bit of a headwind. So, as always, rowing is a rowing sport and we deal with the conditions that we are put into. And we'll see after some food, because remember food is fuel, what the conditions are. Like, oh yeah. And we've made it with Yam. He has rigged up the Lamborghini name yet to be determined to race after fueling up because remember, food is fuel and we need to do that regardless if we're racing, training or doing anything in between. But Yam's distracted by the water as it's very flat right now. So the conditions have stayed pretty nice. I'm hoping by the time we get up to the start line, they stay that way. But we're in the single now. So it's been a three boat class regatta for me in the four and a sweet boat yesterday in the quad today with Eight oars with two oars each. And this afternoon, this last race, two oars, but just by myself. So it'll be really interesting. Three very different speeds, three very different boat classes, but this will be the last one. So last one, fast one, let's get to it. <laughs> my video. Uh, uh. Go and prove hey, it. And we have finished the racing for this weekend at Inverness Head here in Inverness on the canal. The water stayed lovely for that last race in the Yamborghini name yet to be determined. But unfortunately, as you probably noticed, the GoPro did not start on the start line. So I didn't get footage of the race, but the footage that you did see, his Instagram was there from Harry, gracious enough to let me use his footage. So thank you very much, Harry. The race itself, I'll just talk about it a little bit since you guys didn't see it. It was an interesting one because I've never done, I think that's my, that's the longest head race I've done in the single. So I was trying to pace it a little bit off the start, but not pace it, not take it too easy off the start. And then I saw some boats behind me. I was turning around and I was seeing boats coming. So I'm getting closer. So keep going, keep, keep take over this boat. Then you turn around a little bit again, trying to steer through all the bends and see if some puddles of another boat. And then, okay, let's get past that boat. And then sort of last K500, it's quite a good sort of, there's markers every little bit in the last sort of 800 or so here on the canal in Inverness. So it's quite easy to sort of wind into the finish. And I think I had a good solid push in the last part of the race, but overall really enjoyed that race. And speaking of the race in the single, I managed to win in the single. So I won in the single in the Lamborghini name yet to be determined. We won as a crew in the quad and we won as a crew in the four. So a very productive weekend for Edinburgh University, smashing the results. 
smashing the racing and I've really, really enjoyed said racing this weekend. So that will be it for today's episode, Yam Squad. Hopefully you enjoyed episode 10 of season seven and I'm looking forward to episode 11, season seven. So make sure you are subscribed and hitting that notification bell so that you are notified when that episode 11 does come out because it's a little bit different than sort of the head racing stuff we've got going on. There are a couple of more head races to happen but I've also got a little bit of variation because remember, variation is one of the keys to motivation on the channel coming up. And if you like this video or this sort of double episode weekend head regatta format, hit that like button and I will see you in the next episode. Oh yeah.